Ciao, my friend. How's going? Happy weekend. It's Kevin here at the Oligarch store. I wanted to jump on and give you guys my lineup of weekend fragrances. So this weekend, it is very hot today. I think it's, it's, it's very, very, very sunny outside. I've got my terry cotton polo on. To some of you guys, it may look like a beach towel, but this is fashion, baby. <laughs> I've also got my Vietnamese iced coffee here today. <sighs> Refreshing. <laughs> All right, so some of the brands that I wanted to show love this weekend, these are gonna be the scents that I'm wearing. Um, starting off with the first one from Manos Getacunis, my favorite brand out of Greece. Shout out to my friend Manos. This one here is actually one of his best sellers in the brand. It's called Immortal. So we're going to go straight on skin today. Uh, the Immortal is one that is for gourmand lovers with 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 the um, feature of a floral. So it does, of course, have the focus on the Immortal flower, which is a floral that I find has a almost like a sweet, like, like a brown sugar sweet quality about it. Oh, that's gorgeous. It, it's very, very sugary, floral scent. Many people call this his gourmand in the collection. Um, you've got in it, let's have a look here. You've got in an opening, you've got clove, you've got cinnamon. So I'm getting the sweet spices there. Then in the middle is the immortal with a milk accord to it. And in the base is where you have that brown sugar. So you also have got sandalwood and patchouli. It's one that I consider a day scent. So for this kind of weather outside, if you guys look, if you guys look outside today and it's really nice and sunny, there's not a cloud in the sky, it's really nice um, weather. It's perfect for a scent like this, which is what I'm gonna be wearing this morning here. As my day scent, it's Friday. I'll probably wear it again uh, on Sunday, give it another wear, because I know it's really nice and warm on Sunday as well. Oh, that's gorgeous. So quite sugary and I am picking up this milky tone in the background. It's very, very interesting. It's to have a gourmand profile built around the Immortal flower. Um, something that I don't see very often, something very unique and something that you only find in niche. So bravo to Manos because it's one that a lot of people have been buying. Again, it is one of his best sellers in the whole brand. Um, and I've had customer reviews on this. Performance, amazing, longevity, amazing. Performs really well on skin, particularly on those sunny days. So it's made for this kind of weather that we're gonna have. Um, next up is, shout out to my other friend, Elmar. Uh, Delmar Parfums in Switzerland. My dear friend Elmar, this is one of his newer creations from his new lineup. It's called Zaya. So it is one that I consider this, um, more of an evening scent. It's gonna be one that I wear towards uh, later tomorrow evening, Saturday. I've got a 30th birthday on, my cousin, and uh, we'll be going out for drinks. He's got like a whole venue booked out for dinner and I wanted to wear something like this that, that I think is gonna suit the vibe. Let me tell you why. In the notes, you've got the bergamot, which grabs your attention at the start, but you have beautiful notes of cognac, honey, apple in it too, there's nutmeg, so it's quite a warm, boozy scent, very uh, mysterious, very sensual. I'm gonna put this one on my other arm. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, nice, wow. This is blended, it is difficult to pick up individual notes because it's blended so well. In the heart, I'm just looking at the notes at the front here, you've got um, in the heart, with the cognac and the honey, you've got uh, cinnamon, you've got tonka bean, ambers, and oak wood, absolute. In the base, you have vanilla, sandalwood. Um, so this is a perfect, again, I consider this evening scent. So if you're gonna go for something like Immortal by Manos, get a kindness for the day. When you come home, have a shower, get changed for the weekends, going out tonight on Friday, or maybe tomorrow on Saturday, um, picking up a bottle of your Zaya, going into the evening, I think it's a perfect, transition scent there. Um, and with that cognac and that apple, that nutmeg, I think it's perfectly suited for warm evening weather. So this is gonna be a going out scent. And then now for uh, Sunday brunch. Sunday brunch, I've got Vanuatu by Sordora Paris. 
Shout out to my other friends. <laughs> Shout out to Quentin, my man Quentin here. Um, Vanuatu is one that I've been wearing more and more. It's very interesting. Uh, you'll find the best sellers in Sorodora are Gladiator and Brasiliant, which are more of your um, bright, fizzy, uh, attention grabbing scents. You've got Gladiator with that pineapple in it, Brasiliant as that more gourmand, vanilla, caramel, but it's still very bright as well. This one's gonna be my weekender. It's one that I've been wearing just a little bit more recently. Um, and let's have a look here. So you've got uh, this one here, Vanuatu. So Quentin was inspired to make a sandalwood scent and he went to Vanuatu to find the sandalwood that he's gonna use in his fragrance. This is, it has more of a, it's almost like a volcanic sandalwood. It's very, very interesting. I've run out of real estate on my arm, but I might go, I might go here. Isn't that always the problem with us? Niche heads, when you spray too many on your, on your arm and then you, you're gonna be like some of my other customers who come in spraying on their knees, spraying on their legs and stuff. <laughs> okay, Vanuatu. Oh. Sweet spices in the base that I'm picking up. But that sandalwood note is very unique. If you're looking for a sandalwood scent, I found more people in the last few months, for some reason sandalwood is having its time. I think mm, around October, November, it was cherry. Cherry was doing its thing. Everyone was going for cherry scents. Um, right now I'm finding everyone going for sandalwood scents. This is very unique, definitely very unique. Sweet spices in this and the sandalwood it has this almost like a fiery volcanic quality to it. Very interesting. A lot of people have been asking me for creamy sandalwoods. I think a lot of brands, um, their newer sandalwood releases have been quite gourmand, creamy. Some brands have been pairing it with a fig. This is very, very different. Very, very different. So, some things that I wrote in this one. Let me just, whoop. Sorry, guys. Hold up. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I had a meeting with Quentin and, and um, I was asking him about this creation because I was very curious about it. And he said it's the perfume, the perfume of before. The perfume behind it is a student of um, Jean Claude Elena, and it has this signature kind of almost milky accord to it. Wow, that's really almost sandalwood with sweet spicy gourmand quality to it. It's very very interesting. It's hard to describe. You've got to come in and get this on on your skin, Vanuatu. Um, they also have discovery sets, so if you jump onto our website, you might be able to find that we have some discovery sets still available, but I'll be honest, they sell out pretty quick. Um, so I, I'm gonna give this one a test drive on Sunday for brunch. I'll let you guys know how it goes later next week. This has been the lineup of my weekend descents that I'll be wearing, guys. So you've got Immortal by Manos Gerakinis, you've got Zaya by Dalama Parfums, and then you have Vanuatu by Sorodora Paris. Oh, it happens to be kind of like a green thing going on here. <laughs> um, visit a store. I'll be open the whole day today, guys. I'm also open tomorrow and Saturday. Open to close, I'll be here. So pop on by, come say hello. We've got all the new brands. Uh, Stefan Humbert Luca and Sospiro that's available in store now. So come in and try that. And uh, yeah, have a great weekend. It's amazing weather. So I do recommend getting some sunshine, heading out there, wearing your more outdoorsy sense. Um, explore a little, I think. Play around, maybe even do a bit of layering, actually, that would be really, really fun. And let me let me uh, know in the comments, what will you guys be wearing this weekend? What's gonna be your weekend sense for this sunny weather on Saturday? I think it's extremely, extremely hot. So I'm curious to know what you guys will be wearing. Um, and I'll give you guys an update on these scents uh, later on after the weekend. See you guys, ciao, bye for now.